be a whole bunch of videos put together. Alright, so I'm gonna go this way. So another cool thing they could add is like a somehow level up system. I don't know, like you kill this many things and you get something, I don't know. Pretty legit, if you ask me. I made a good amount of money. Talk to the merchant for a second. Sell this. I have no use for it. Buy some more of these. Hey, get off my seller's house. Get off, get off. MLG, get off me. Get off my lawn. This is a good way to make money though. These things are pretty easy to kill. I make more money than I do buying the health potions, so this is working out. Die, son! Die! Gosh, this is a really long night. Oh, it's only halfway done. I see the move now. Gosh. Alright, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and stop this for just a little bit. And because I think this might be getting boring to watch. And I will come back when the night is over. Alright guys, so I'm back. It's daytime. I deposited a whole bunch of money that I earned. And I think what I'm doing is I'm all nice and healed up, so I'm heading back down in the caves, hopefully to find a skeleton to kill or something. I'm not sure. And we'll see what happens. Clear out all these vines that are I honestly don't understand the point of them all, or whatever, you know. They just get them annoying me. It's like I have OCD with them. Uh, let's get down here. And these mines go pretty dang deep. Oh yeah, I remember, I gotta clear out a whole bunch of stuff, because I was trying to jump up here before. And I'll probably do the same thing again, it's a pain. That's why I need the grappling hook, I can just grip myself up. But, instead of like, building a whole bunch of dirt towers to jump up on. No, I passed by that iron horse so much in his self gun. I'm gonna get it right now. Okay. Come on. There's also some copper ore behind that. So I'll also take it gladly. Also guys, Minecraft 1.6 came out, just thought I'd inform you, but I don't know if y'all play, but uh, I'm not really sure I'm going to make a video of it, because there's not too much new stuff that I saw, I mean, honestly, I think that's what's going to make Terraria better than Minecraft, even, I mean, they're different games though, so you can't really say that it's going to replace Minecraft, but it can definitely make it better than Minecraft, because what, as long as they follow like what they said for Tori, where they're gonna actually update it more often. Or, you know, like weekly or whatever. Then it'll make it a lot better, because... Minecraft, they update it, but all they do is do small little updates, like add a map. And add some other small stuff, like hatchets and tall grass. And it's basically just destroying mods and not helping us really... Or not making a very exciting update that really would make it worth replacing our mods for. So it kind of makes me angry, but 
You know, you can choose not to up update it, but I still do it anyway. And that just makes me, after the update, I just play it a little bit, and I wait a while till I actually feel like installing the mods again, because sometimes they don't work right away, and it gets to be a pain. Now I'm just jumping around. I still haven't made it to the bottom yet. I still have a while to go, I think. I mean, I made this freaking far away. I, mean, I didn't choose to. I mean, some of it's just, not all of this is dug by me, obviously. Some of it's just natural caves, and then me digging through parts of it, finding new caves connected together. And I'm almost getting close. To, I think I'm almost at the bottom now. really light up this area a little bit. I guess I'll keep heading down. Down, down, down. And this is why I need a grappling hook. Of course, you know, if I want to, instead of having to climb all this back up right now, I can just, like, die and not care about the money I get. Because I still keep all my items. So I do get the thing that I want for like the hook or whatever it is, and the skeleton drop. And then uh I'll just die. So I don't have to worry about doing this again, it's just a pain in the butt. Alright, so I finally almost at the bottom, I think. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Kit. I mean, it's pretty dang deep. I don't even know if there's like a limit to the bottom of this map or not, like how there is in Minecraft. I'm not really sure where it is, because I've gone so far down. I'm surprised I haven't reached like the this game version of Bedrock or whatever it might be. Ernest. Oh, there's a skeleton. Yes. Awesome. I don't want to knock him off because it'll be a pain. So I'll just slowly kill him, I guess. There's another one, too. Look at him trying to get to me. Look at, look at him down there. And he didn't drop it. Come on, buddy, I'll fight you. I got stuck in freaking cobwebs. Okay. Let's go. I wonder if I got anything. I'm not sure. It's hard to tell what you pick up in this game. That's one thing, but I don't really know how they'd change that. Did I get it? No, I don't see anything. People said it was a pretty rare drop. Kind of annoys me. Skeletons are already kind of rare as it is. You have to go way this far down just to find them. I don't even know how I got a whoopee cushion. Whatever. I I didn't get it, so I gotta keep searching. More skeletons to find. Let's go over here. There's no thing over there. Oh my gosh, man. Looks like I'm gonna have to dig farther down. That sucks. Alright guys, well I'm just gonna have to finish up this recording right now. Hopefully I can find more skeletons next time. Thanks for watching. Expect more videos on, on the Xbox and uh, on uh, Pokemon Yellow sooner or later. Bye bye.